change the cabin air filter in the truck. Why? Because we all forget we have them and that air in there is just stale as can be. So let's get to it. All right guys, the first thing we wanna do is uh, open up the glove box. We wanna get all the garbage out. Why? We don't need it in here. Or it's gonna fall to the ground. Next thing you wanna do is come over here and take this clip on the side, kinda slide it down, push it out of the way. That, that's what retracts this glove box. If you let it go, it'll just kinda hang tight right in there. Second thing you wanna do, Push in the two sides of your glove box here and here. See these tabs? Glove box, bam, comes right out. All right, the next thing you want to do is way under here, in this little box right here, it's kind of long, are there's uh, little tabs. So what you do is you, you reach over on one side and you push in the tab and pull it out. And then right here, go ahead and push that in pull out the cover. So here you have the cover, here's the tab, one on each side, and once that's free, you can see the filter sitting right there. Go ahead and pull that out. Pull it all the way out and see how much dust you've collected throughout the years because you forgot you had a filter. Okay, so the filter I grabbed was from Napa, part number 4579. Go ahead and pull it out of the box. On the filter, just take a look at it to make sure you know the arrow, which will give you the direction of the flow. So right now, it says flow's going down with the arrow. So what I'm gonna do is take it, insert it back into the hole where the old one came out. like that. All right, now that you have the filter in place, it does stick out a little bit because this cover will take care of the rest. Just go ahead and put it back into place. Snap the cover in on both sides and now you've changed out your filter. Now let's put the glove box back on. All right, for the final step, just put the glove box back where it came from. So if you look underneath here, we got four. Um, they're not tabs, but that's kind of where the uh, plastic bar goes on all four sections. So go ahead and line up your four sections here. Kind of give a little pressure just to make sure they sit in place. One thing you don't want to forget is the retractable tab. This part's a little tricky, but if you pull it out, then have to push in both sides of the tab to get the glove box back where it goes. You insert the tab and let it sit in place. Make sure it closes properly, which in this case, it didn't. So go ahead and push down and make sure they're locked in all the way. It shuts nicely. The last thing you don't want to forget is to put your crap back in your box. There you have it. We changed the cabin air filter.